Welcome to the Mantis Bible Study 4 video series. This is the new Tap and Hold Define feature, which is new in Mantis Bible Study 4.9.1 and above. This allows you to define words and phrases from any installed dictionary right in line inside the text. And I'm going to show you how this works. All you need to do is tap and hold on a word that you'd like to look up in all of your installed dictionaries. Now, of course, if you don't have any dictionaries installed, this isn't going to work. But if you've purchased one or more dictionaries, dictionaries for Mantis Bible Study. Just tap and hold on a word. In this case, I'm in Genesis chapter 10, and I'm going to tap and hold on Magog. And I'm going to just tap more and tap define. And what this is going to do is bring an inline definition right inside the text here. So I still have my text on the screen, and it's going to give me links to all of my installed dictionaries that are based on English words, not Strong's dictionaries like Thayer's Greek definitions, but English dictionaries, Easton's Bible Dictionary, Hitchcock Bible Names, International Standard Bible Encyclopedia, etc. Um, any blue links show that we have a direct entry for the word Magog. Uh, any gray links show that there is no entry uh, for Magog, so it's pointless to click on these or tap on these because it's just going to say not found. But I do have an entry for Easton's Bible Dictionary, so I can tap that link to uh, get the uh, Easton's definition of Magog and if I tap the link again it goes away. Hitchcock's Bible names is great for looking up uh, names and finding out what they mean. In this case it means covering roof or dissolving uh, which is kinda interesting and uh, the International Bible uh, Standard Bible Encyclopedia gives a real nice full definition here with uh, links that I can tap to read any embedded verses in the in the definition. It's really cool. And again, if I, I can tap uh, the ISBE link again and it goes away. And if I tap the red X, it will get rid of the definition. So I can define anything, anywhere, read it, and then uh, close it and still not lose the context of where, where I'm reading. Again, if you uh, select multiple words in a phrase, it's going to look up that phrase in the dictionary. Most likely you're not going to get a hit unless it, the phrase goes together as a single entry. This has been uh, the tap and hold highlight feature of Mantis Bible Study 4.9.1.